for the last time. El Nino is not a storm. What is El Nino? El Nino is the warm phase of the El Nino Southern Oscillation, or ENSO for short. And El Nino is taking place when sea surface temperatures are warming by at least 0.5 degrees Celsius or 0.9 degrees Fahrenheit for at least three months, particularly around the east central portion of the Pacific Ocean and the tropical areas. Normally, the Humboldt current flows north along the Pacific coast of South America, bringing in cold surface water. During an El Nino, the equatorial current surges southward along the South American coast, bringing in warm surface water. In short, no, El Nino is not a storm. However, it can cause a lot of storms. The events that take place on that part of the Pacific Ocean can have ramifications in other parts of the world causing warmer than average winters in places like the Midwestern United States, cooler, wetter winters in Northeast Mexico, heavy rains in East Africa during March and May, and you have issues with drought in the Western Pacific. And look at the ramifications for the West Coast of South America. Fishing is a very important part of the economy on the West Coast of South America. Those cold ocean waters caused by the Humboldt Current they're nutrient rich, they bring in a lot of fish, a lot of fish like sardines, anchovies, many other types that are very important to the economy. With the equatorial current surging southward, that would bring a lot of nutrient poor water and cause a lot of problems. It would have ramifications for the economy. El Nino would have ramifications for weather patterns throughout the world. And that's one reason we need to learn about El Nino and one reason we need to learn about geography. I hope you found this video informative and it clears up some misunderstandings. Leave a comment, like, and subscribe. Hey, get back here. You gotta subscribe.